Hey, it's Tony with Build a Dream. I usually don't make videos like these and I'll possibly never make a video like this ever again. But I thought it might help a few creators out there. So last week, me and my buddies went to Linville Gorge to shoot a hiking video as what we usually do. And we accidentally made an extremely viral TikTok video of me rock climbing. Dude, 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 dude. Okay, calm down, calm down. Shut up! You got it. Focus. Where do I put my hand? Dude, where do I put my hand? Get your right foot up. Dude. Get your right foot up. I can't. Get your right foot up. I, I, I can't. I don't want to do it anymore. Or fake rock climbing. But the video was posted about four days ago on May 23rd. And as of now, while recording this video on May 27th, it has 9.7 million views and over a million likes. The TikTok was posted on Lural, or Live in Real Life, and is directly connected to my YouTube channel, Build a Dream. While my buddy John's extremely new TikTok account got roughly 7,000 followers from that one video in four days, the question becomes from a very viral TikTok video, how many YouTube subscribers does it translate into if that TikTok is connected to the YouTube channel? Let's take a look. As you can see, the channel's daily subscribers hovers anywhere between one to eight subscribers per day, but the overall mean comes out to roughly four to five per day. So on Tuesday, the video dropped and the channel got six subscribers. Wednesday, it got another six subscribers. And Thursday, the channel got a whopping 17 subscribers and Friday, 16 subscribers. Then on Saturday, it went back down to four subscribers. So hypothetically, at absolute best case scenario, if every single subscriber was from the TikTok video and I didn't get any other subscribers that day, somehow, some way, 9.7 million TikTok views translates into 49 YouTube subscribers. But realistically, it's more like 20-ish. And to make news like that even worse, that bump between Thursday and Friday also occurred because we released a lot of YouTube shorts in those days. However, there is a twist. Since that TikTok channel is not mine, it's my buddy John's, it goes under a different name. Whereas my YouTube channel goes under Build the Dream, his channel goes under Live in Real Life. So when people click on the link, they'll see a different name, which might play a factor and confuse some people. But at the same time, as I said, it is directly linked from here, and the TikTok bio even says YouTube link in the description, along with the separate link in the bio as well. So, I don't know, but for me, a lucky viral TikTok video translates into not too many YouTube subscribers. I do know that TikTok is good for exposure, I guess, but as far as brand building and all that other business stuff goes, I'm not the guy for that. All I can speak on are my results for this one instance where the TikTok algorithm god decided to be nice. But I have no regrets for the video besides the shirt I wore. I, uh, Made a lot of sayings look bad. But aside from that, if you need any ideas for hiking trips with your friends and family to live a more fulfilling and balanced life, subscribe to this channel. And if you want to see our journey to remnants of the last ice age, which is also the second most endangered force in this country in the Smoky Mountains, see that video here. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day.